The state government has continued with the replacement and extension of pipelines in areas without water across the metropolis and its outskirts. Governor Peter Mbawi was on inspection tour of some ongoing water supply extension projects in some parts of the capital city yesterday charged residents to take ownership of the water facilities and protect them against sabotage and vandalism, warning those deliberately vandalizing state assets leading to frequent leakage of water and a huge cost to the government to desist from the illegal act or face severe consequences. People have been going around doing all sorts of things, including cutting pipelines, vandalizing uh, water collection points, just stealing the herb, and uh, some, in some instances breaking the pipes completely. There are two things that we have thought about doing as a government. One is to provide adequate security in this, some of these locations, but more important is for communities to take ownership of the infrastructure being brought to their communities. These are people that have not had water over a decade. So we brought water to them, put those points as first line intervention pending when the reticulation gets into their homes. So we also expect in working with the chairman, the councillors, some of the community leaders, the PG leaders, to be able to now say to them, government is doing what they are promised now to ensure the sustainability of this infrastructure you have to be committed in that process and that's the conversation we had with them earlier and there was commitment but you do know in this things there are going to be outliers there are going to be instances where people are going to try to push an agenda that's contrary so that's what you're seeing but when you look at the quantum of, of, of vandalism going on it's not the way it would have been if it hadn't been for the interventions we have put in place at the start of this strategy. So this is something that we are working very actively. Uh, His Excellency is very, very uh, uh, intentional about the whole process of providing security, but it has to be a collective effort. It can't be an effort of something that's being done out of the Lion Building. Everybody has to be involved in safeguarding this and changing the narrative around Enugu. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.